Nmap tutorial for beginners. How to use Nmap to develop apps and how it works you with your security and scanning. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be giving you an overview tutorial for Nmap, how to install Nmap, download and how it works. So let's get into it. First of all, what you need to do is you can go to nmap.org and you will get on this website right here. This is the official website for Nmap. A mobile friendly layout is also available on npcap.com so you can go ahead and check it out from here what is nmap well nmap is for our security and scanning of our website that we're creating for our application it is a developing framework that we get it's an open and free source utility for network discovery and security auditing many system and network administration also find it useful for tasks such as network inventory managing service upgrade schedule and monitoring host or service up time so this is like a very good you know, explanation of nmap which is also known as a network mapper so this is our network mapper where we get everything we need and it helps us with our managing and upgrading our schedule for our website so how to get nmap and how to download well you can see the download link right here at the first option and once we click on download so we have get the latest nmap for your system so we have windows mac linux and other os so wherever you you're working you can just select i'm going to select windows because this is where i'm working and uh, now it's actually showing me how to install it okay so we know latest table release this is the latest version which is 7.92 okay and i need to download this one or i can go with ncap self installer so i'm gonna go with the windows one of course the stable one click on it and it will start downloading your installer right here you can see it will just take a few minutes to install so i'm gonna just give it few minutes and see you in a bit so once it's downloaded i'm gonna click right here and it will open up my installer for me and then i will be able to install nmap so for nmap we actually need zenmap first and then it allows us to download nmap okay so i'm gonna click on yes and then we're gonna simply install it click on i agree next and install so now it will just take like few seconds to install it's installing you can see please wait while nmap is being installed so that is how easy it is to install nmap on your windows laptop and even on your mac so you'll just select the map option i am downloading it on microsoft windows right now and this will just take a few seconds so once it's installed, you're going to click on I agree and install again. So you're going to click on install PCAP in WinCAP API. Yes. So I'm going to click on install and then it's also going to take just like a few seconds to install this one. So once it's done, I'm going to click on finish and it will be finished. Now you have the installer in your laptop or your PC. Now you're going to go ahead and once it's done, you will be able to install it within your computer as well. So again, we're getting a for Mac here. If you're using Mac, then you will download this version right here. And we also have a source code distribution if you want to use that. So this is how you install and download and Mac now let's move on to documents so go to documents right here again on the website we have documents available and in nmap documents we will be able to check all the documents that we have so first of all nmap is available in 15 languages so if you want to check the documents in any other language then you can select from here this is actually a pretty good uh, way of translating their documents and giving access to all the people around the world so this is like pretty impressive a lot of frameworks don't do that so we have our documents right here in documents we are getting of course our detection system we have our zen map user guide so now what is zen map well zen map is actually a and map is actually a cross platform with zen map just which is a gui so if you have installed your end map then you can go with zen map as well because zen map is the official end map security scanner gui it is multi-perform multi-perform means that it is available on linux window mac os and bsg free and open source application 
section which aims to make nmap easy for beginners so now you have installed nmap what i would suggest is simply go to zen map and what you can do is we have different frameworks for each of the platform for example for python we have a lot of different frameworks that make it easy for us to use we have dolang which is actually also another same kind of working which is a same working uh framework and that what happens is it makes easy for us to use other platforms so similarly we have zen map for nmap if, if you're doing programming on nmap you have installed it you're developing an application you can go ahead and check out zen map as well which is actually the official security scanner and it is a gui and it is also a command creator a command creator allows interactive creation of nmap command lines scan results can be saved and viewed later saved scan results can be compared with one another to see how they differ so this is like an example for you how it works with zen map and you can actually get all of the codes right here and if we talk about the reference guide now so in reference guide we're getting a description we have summaries we have different options available as well and here you will also be able to find the representative of nmap scan so this is our nmap scan given right here now, this is example for you and in this example it shows you how to enable os and version detection script scanning and other thing as well so this is like an nmap scan that you can simply go so you can get a, a copy of nmap of course the framework of nmap on github as well it's available there too and then it's also available on npcap.com, seclist.org, sectools.org, and insecure.org. So the Nmap is our security system that will help us develop an application. Uh, the output from Nmap is a list of a scan targets with supplement information on each depending on the option used. Key among that information is the interesting port tables, the table list, the port number, and protocol, service name, and state. The state is either open, filtered, closed, or unfiltered open means that an application on the target machine is listened for connection packets on that port so all of the nmap information is given on the website right here i showed you how to install it how to use the document what is zen map and i hope now you have a better idea that how it is used and an interesting thing about nmap is that nmap is used in movies so hollywood has decided that nmap is the tool to show whenever hacking scenes are needed at least it is a lot more realistic than silly 3d animation approach so what a um, movies do is they use these you can see right here whenever there is a hacking scene they are using nmap for this one for some reason you can say that nmap is the tool for hollywood because it has been featured in a lot of movies and they are proud of it and map you can see so yeah this is actually a, an interesting information and you can check it out right here and you are getting all the information on nmap's official website so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was big help to you and now you know how to install and map uh, the documents for nmap zen map and how to simply use it an overview of nmap what it is and how it helps you to develop your applications and tools don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel